Aloy, wasn't expecting to see you in Scalding Spear. I hear you fixed the wound. And stopped the war within our clan. I was just lucky your commander was willing to listen. Wasn't luck that took down the bulwark. Or fought off Regala. What's next? Saving the world? <sighs> if I'm lucky. Um... Have you been to Plainsong? Did you see Corey? I haven't had the chance. Oh. At the ready, soldiers. What's going on? My squad's being sent on patrol northwest of here. I won't be able to see Corey for a long time. I wonder if you could let him know. I don't want him to think I've abandoned him. We are moving out. Please. If I find my way to Plainsong, I'll let him know. Sakura. I will leave your scab ass behind. Thank you, Aloy. I told him he's gonna get himself killed. No. Does anyone listen to old Embar? Hey, Lloyd. I hear you've been making quite the impression on the clan lands. Saving the Desert Clan from itself, forcing the Commander Takote out of hiding, defending the Grove from Regala. I didn't do it alone. The humble words of a true warrior. Your sister sent me. Her squad's been assigned further west, so she won't be able to come see you, Akore. She wanted to make sure you knew. That sounds like my sister. Is something wrong? No. Yes. There's this song I want to play. One of my own making, but it's hopeless. I'm just never going to get the sound right. What makes you say that? Back in the clan lands, the Sky Clan built instruments that cast sound to sky and across the mountains. They use long leg throats to make them bellow with the sound of metal. It's how they communicate between villages. Combining that sound with the Utarus would create a melody unlike anyone's ever heard before. But I won't be hunting for any long legs anytime soon. For now, you should try to metal weaver again. They might have some new piece you can use. Right. This song means a lot to him, doesn't it? It does, which is why I'm getting him that machine part. It'll be a surprise. The Utaru say that's the best way to receive a gift. Is there a long leg around here? As it happens, one has been troubling some villages southwest of here. You be doing me and playing Song of Favor by getting rid of it. Interested? Maybe. If I make my way down there, I'd like to help. I appreciate that. I'll head southwest and see if I can pick up a trail. No running, children. Walking. Fields are plenty. Yep.
Nice. Hey, Lord. Nice of you to join me. Thought you could use the backup. You okay? You arrived not a moment too soon, Huntress. I thought I heard a long legs call, so I hastened to follow, but I was caught unaware by these machines instead. There it is again. Let's go find it. at the top of that cliff. Oh, looks like we're climbing. We'll make quick work of it. <laughs> this reminds me of my early days as a veteran. Always running off to hunt in the wilds. As far away from plain song as possible. What changed? I saw my first Utaru students become fighters worthy of any Tanakh clan. I felt useful, like I belong. And so Plain Song became home. I'm sure Corey will find his place too. I hope so. Almost there. Oh, it sounds like that long leg isn't alone up there. I'm afraid you might be right. There's our long leg. And the Utaru that fell. Might be best to silence it before it can call reinforcements. Frost would do a lot of damage. On you, Aloy. We're in trouble. Wouldn't want to be on the other end of that.
We should clear the area. Make sure these machines don't endanger other villages. Right. Follow my lead. Time to make a little noise of our own. Have some ammo, Aloy! to show me our prize, Huntress? Many thanks, Aloy. Without you, I might have been in trouble. Why don't you take that piece to Corey for me? The villagers felled by these machines need to have their seeds buried properly first. Are you sure? Tell Corey I better be the first to hear that song of his when I return. you had left plain song well i thought about it but then i'd have to carry this long leg throat all by myself you found jacks did <laughs> that old man can still hear perfectly fine so let's hear it i'm gonna need some aloy can you take this to the workbench please you won't have to do much i promise You'll see a... Wide cavity on the instrument. You want that piece should... I think it's good to go.
A song of two peoples indeed. Thank you, Aloy. My debt to you seems to only grow. Hearing that was payment enough. That may be, but you should at least take this. You deserve it. May the wings of the ten hearten your step. Donna wanted to see you. <laughs> Don't know why, though. Where'd she go? Just what I need. A bird with a bad omen. In her car, was on her. Bird trouble? Damn thing's a curse. Sometimes I think being commander's a curse. That Yara's laughing at me from beyond the grave. What's wrong? Her stupid bird flew in yesterday with this in its beak. It's a cord that Tanakh children use to carry their training swords. The kind of thing one of our young doesn't lose unless something bad has happened. I checked around. Turns out a kid's missing. Wandered off the day before last. Search parties turned up nothing. The clan's lost kids before, just not while I'm in charge. Let me see that thing. There's a bit of quartz on here. It's probably sand. Some dirt and clay with a red hue. Sand, dirt, and red clay? I know a spot where all three meet. Just south of the settlement. Meet me there as soon as you can. Wait, you're not just gonna send someone? Well, what if we need that relic of yours again? Besides, you and me rescuing a kid? The clan will eat that up. Right, because making you look good is what's important. Away from here, not on the floor. People in trouble. Nora, hey, over here. You, Nora. I can turn the sword. Can you assist us with these chargers? We're just getting Nora's fighting the chargers. Uh, that doesn't mean you can stop fighting them. <laughs> now we have a chance. Watch them. We're not out of this yet. Pick your target. Take your time. Fire discipline, Hatakto. Hit that one, Kitaka! Right to the challenge! There! That's the last of the Chargers. Let's find out what those Tanakh are doing here. How did you end up in trouble with those chargers? You need to answer our questions. We don't answer yours. Hatakto, this must be the Nora who defeated Regala at the Grove. That doesn't mean she's an ally. That's pretty much exactly what that means. And we've enough to do chasing down these Regala zealots without picking fights with Nora warriors. Regala's Desert Tanakh. 
We should be fighting alongside her instead of sitting this out. Regala has forgotten her duty. And let her anger at the Karja draw us into... We will speak about this later. You fought with courage and honor. You're free to go on to the Grove, Nora. If Regala's broken her duty, then why aren't we bringing her to justice? Because we follow orders. Draka should be around here somewhere. I need to help him look for that missing kid. Come on over. Let's talk. So, this is it. Sand, dirt, red clay. Just like you said from looking at the kid's cord. You want to use that fancy relic of yours to look around? See if he was here? You might want to start near the bird. Keep squawking like it knows something. It's Stupid flying vermin. Yeah, I'm on it. Looks like frost is no good here. Yeah, small footprints. Faint, but the tracks lead away from here. Draka, I found a trail. It might be the child. And what are we waiting for? Let's go. You all right? You seem a little down. Guess so. Turns out that more power means more problems. I thought that with Yara finally gone, I could just make things better. Doesn't really work that way, huh? Everyone wants everything all I'm the time. Done. Food, water, protect... It's annoyingly impatient. When they don't get what they want, the blades come out. I remind you of anything? Yeah, me with Yara. I get it. Okay, you made your point. Wait. I'm stuck in here! Did you hear that? Maybe that damn bird help. does know something. I think the kid's in that ancient wreck. There you are. You're safe now. No! There's machines out there! Time for a scrap! Uh-oh. By the ten! That thing won't go down easy! Ah. Come on, Aloy! Get up! <laughs> Aloy! Grab this ammo! <laughs> Are you seriously leaving right now?
we're about to have a party crasher. The more the merrier. Don't have enough stamina yet. Desert flame strikes again. Well done.
It's okay. Okay, little soldier. You're all right now. What happened? I, I, I just wanted to go on a hunt, but I got lost, and then the machines chased me, and... Oh, okay, okay. You're safe now. All right, just, just give me a minute with my friend here, and then I'll take you back to Scalding Spear. Th thank you, Commander. Hey, no need for rank. Just call me Draka. You really helped me out. I'd like to say I could have taken those machines one-on-one, -on -one, but... The kid's okay. That's all that matters. Yeah. His parents will be glad to have him back. His squad, too. And the rest of the clan? I won't lie. I needed a win. It'll help shore up my support. Glad I could help. Just remember, you took the job. Now you have to live up to your responsibilities. I know, I know. I have to rise to the challenge for the clan. No other option. Did I just hear... humility? Of course. I'm great at that. Oh, uh, before I forget. Here, take this. Couldn't have done this without you. Oh, and don't worry about the kid. I'll get him home safe. Everything okay? What are you doing out here? Ask my grandmother. I risked leaving guard duty to look for her. She stopped to see the bloom, and now she won't leave. Since when does she care about flowers? They're not just flowers, child. They're scarlet stems with the scent that soothes the nerves. Or so I was told many years ago by an Utaru seed tracker. An Utaru? Now you're telling stories. If one trespassed here back then, you'd have killed him on sight. I couldn't. Found him picking flowers. Right near here, in Tanakh territory. I was all set to strike him down, but he was singing. <laughs> singing? Can't remember the tune now. Just the lilt of his voice. And his name. Nilo. He decided to stay for a day or two. I took guard duty here so I could keep coming back to him. And he kept delaying his return to plain song. For the flowers, he said. Please don't tell me I'm descended from a Utaro gardener. Almost. Almost. But the thrill of battle called to me, and he had to return to his people. I've always wondered about the life I missed with him, whether he misses it too. Would he welcome me in plain song, or at least accept a scarlet stem? It's a long way to plain song, but I get back there now and then. I could pick some scarlet stems and bring them to Nilo, if I can find him. Please. He was an herbalist there. I know the time has long since passed, but I'd like to know. Well, I'd like him to know. Ugh, you know what I mean. I think I do. Encouraging an old woman? Why would you do that? Why wouldn't I? She'll find that Nilo guy? I thought you didn't care. I don't. Not really.
now. It's been some time. Good to see you. I'm not joking. Outlander, what can I do for you? You're the herbalist here, right? Are you Nilo? No, Nilo was before my time. I think he went up north a while back to river him. Why? Do you need a special solve? No, but someone else does, in a way. Thanks. I'll try river him. There's a grove there, a, a memorial, a beautiful greenery. If he's there, I, I bet he'll be tending it. Thanks again. Glad I could help. I hope you find what you're looking for in River. I'd avoid the field with the All the scouts could say was that they're being led by two. Okay, we start River the strike in the hunt. In I should the look for Nilo. Give him the Scarlet Stones. The herbalist in plain song said he might be near the memorial grove. Ada, Mune, Nilo. Did she say Nilo? Uh, hi there. Nora, here. You're a long way from home. I suppose I am. I'm looking for an herbalist named Nilo. I think I heard you say his name. You've come to the right place. His seeds were buried here, where he tended the blooms of others, including my mother's. I'm his daughter, Gia. How long has he been gone? Some five years now. He put a lot of love into this grove, almost as much as he gave me. That's why I could never abandon River Him. I'd like to leave some flowers, if I may, from an old friend of his. <laughs> Scarlet stems. They're rare in these parts, but they were his favorite. I never knew why. He planted them whenever he could, but never picked them. Prefer to just watch them bloom. Sounds about right. So he was a good man, who led a full life? He was. And he did. I don't know who this old friend is, but if my father liked them, they must be a good soul. Look, the Outlander's back. I can still see well enough, girl. Is my long vigil over? You have word from my grandmother's gardener? Yes and no. I laid the scarlet stems at his grave. His favorite flower, according to his daughter. Always loved to watch them bloom. He's gone. But he did think of me over the years. That'll have to be enough. Really? That's it? Are you sure you got the right guard... Uh, herbalist? Huh. Seemed like you thought it was a fool's errand. Well, it's just that it meant something to you. It could have been a whole other life. Could have been. But this life hasn't turned out so bad. I even have a granddaughter who cares enough to come looking for me out in the wilds. And I've still got scarlet stems to remind me of Nilo. Sounds like your grandmother's got it all figured out. Maybe she does. Just 
Tell me the next time you want to come out here, okay? Instead of disappearing? Maybe I will. Here, Outlander. Take this. For helping an old woman to remember she was once young. <laughs>